Hello, hello everyone, and welcome to another episode of Transport City 2. So, you, as you can see, we have some new trucks here on this line delivering food to our city nearby, and the city is Akron. So, this is uh, doing as much as they can. We are not producing that many at the moment, although we still have a lot of food stored. So this will probably benefit from connection to some other areas which we don't have any at the moment. So I won't worry too much about that. But in any case, in today's episode, I won't be looking at this area. What I want to do here is build a highway connecting some other cities. So what I have in mind, I don't know if that will be too much for today, but we are going to start connecting Fremont to Fresno, then to Tampa and to McAllen. For the places where we already have uh, a road there, we will be upgrading that to a highway or something uh, a bit better so we can uh, use that as much as we can. And I just saw that we do have some uh, machines stored here. I hope this is not just too much. Our lines are all making money. That's good. I'll take a look at this one and see if we can update those trucks so they can carry a little bit more. So let's replace it. They are in very bad condition anyway. So we are transporting machinery. This one carries all cargo. Let's just replace it and we should be good so new trucks here as well and hopefully this city will appreciate that so we are delivering enough for them at the moment which is pretty good but then we do have to work on that highway and i think the way that we can do this is let's just start somewhere and then we we can work through that uh, what I'm thinking about this is to actually go through this area and connect here somewhere. We do want... Oh, we now have planes. Nice. So probably start using planes to move the food on the other side later on. So let's get into it. I think that's the best way to make things happen. And we have this large switch, which is the best one we can have at the moment. So what I'll do here is going on a straight line, just there. And then we start slowly changing. Let me see if that's exactly what I want. Just a little bit over there. Should be good. Then we go on a straight line again. And back to this one. We can make a connection. Oh, mm -hmm. I just noticed that this doesn't look very good. I think that's where I come in and smooth everything out so we have a nicer area instead of that ugly bump over there I would say there you go and then we can connect that again maybe I'll just do it straight and we can just connect it there Okay, that looks good actually. So we have that highway, it's connecting over there. This is a really nice highway there. Well, it's not, in theory, not a highway per se, because this is actually a large street only. But I think that's what we can change that to afterwards. I'll have to... Hmm. Let them go here, and then I'll have to pause 
and remove some of these roads around here. Okay, and then they get into here. So I'm connected there, I'm connected here, and I'm connected here as well. But that one doesn't look right. So let's upgrade this bit here as well. And I think now we are good. So this should increase the traffic between those cities. Now we need to connect Tempe as well. And what I'm thinking to do is to actually come here, use these roads and connect somewhere around here. Let's see what's the best way to do that. I might do it throughout the whole place. I don't know, I feel like this is a good idea to just make sure this goes through the whole city. Maybe I'll do this like here as well. Oh, we don't need all that area there, so I'll leave it just there. Cool. And then we need some road connections here as well. Get a bit of curve in there. And in here as well. So we have those connections back. And we now connected almost everything, although this one are already connected. I think it's uh, fair to say that we can improve this. So let's take a look at that right now. Let's start upgrading this as well. Going a bit like this and getting into the city over there and going straight so we can connect both sides here. Yes, that's very good. We have this connection here. I can probably remove this one. And let's reconnect this one. Nice, this looks good. Okay, that's good. We have now those connections and we probably can start looking into building some um, public transport between those cities because I think this will help them grow and I want to do it. Oh, I just thought about this now. This city doesn't have any major roads coming into the city. I might change it. Yeah, this looks a little bit better there. And then we can remove that connection. Okay, that's sorted. Now I think we we have some good places here. Let's look at passengers. We do have plenty in here. Interesting. So let's start connecting things. Uh, bus stop. Buildings, bus stop. So what I want to do, I'll probably get two stops in here. I think that'll be enough for them. Let's do one around here. First bus stop, yay! And a new vehicle is available. And I'll do another one around here. And then we go all the way to Fresno. Well, I definitely want one here. I just don't know if I want one there or there. Or even... Oh, hold on. 
Mm, we should take a look at this as well. There's a lot of people going to Topeka. Maybe I will get... I could change these roads and make it... Let me take a look at that. Oh, now we have a new road as well. And this is an extra large street. I'll move this here, this there, and I'll actually use this one in there. Just a bit too curvy for my liking, but it's alright. And getting there, it's just... Let me see here. Well, we definitely want one there. I think I'll just get it in here. And maybe one here as well. I know I'm doing a lot more than I initially was set to do, but I think this all makes sense, right? And I want another one... Probably around here. And there. I think I'll put it on both sides, so we don't need to worry too much about which way we are going here. So let's go back there. So one there and one there. Oh, a new train. A lot of new things are coming. So that's, I think that's uh, enough for starting. What I I uh, really want to connect this city as well, but then I'll have to connect all of them. Um, I think we can start looking into a line from Fremont to Fresno, but I don't know if I go all the way there. That's my only concern. I think I'll, I'll do it. So let's get one from here to here. In there, there, there. Okay, but then we want to stop back here, there, because I want to do both ways, right? And then this one, and then we finish here. Okay, that'll be a big line. So we probably need a few vehicles here. So let's get passenger uh, 35 kilometers per hour, which seems like it's not enough. But let's let's see how this goes. Let's give it a try. And then we have to paint this color and send to line 1, which I will change the name. So let's change it to Fremont First Passenger Waiting. Nice! So Fremont Fresno Topica. Fremont First Bus Arrives. Fresno to pick up and how do I say that this is a passenger line or ju ju I just leave it passenger maybe let's just keep an eye on this look at all those buses <laughs> I think this will start to space out uh, eventually 
hopefully. But we do have people waiting there already. So, yeah, we have a few people waiting there. 17 plus 7, so on the other side. Yeah, this should. I think this would be a good line actually. This will end up making us some money. They are going probably on the other way around, so yeah, they are being redistributed. Good, that's exactly what we want. Uh, station is overloaded. So we should get that sorted, like so, yeah, nice. Anywhere else that we have an overloaded station, probably people waiting on that other side as well. So the idea is that we wait for 115 seconds, so two minutes. Maybe a little bit longer. Maybe we need more buses in there. How many people do we have here? 26. Uh, maybe that's a good idea, but let's wait just a bit and see how that goes. And then... We are connected there, we are connected there. We have those main roads connected. I think we do have this one as well. Now, big question. Do we go from Fremont to Tempe? Or Fremont then Fresno and from Fresno to Tempe? I'll keep an eye on this one. Maybe from Fresno... If you want to go to, from Fremont to Tempe, you have to go to Fresno before you get in there. Or even from here, but this would be a, a big distance. I think one more line, just connecting those two, would be good as well. Let's get some bus stops in there then. So from this one, let's get you guys from here to there and back here. Still a lot of people waiting on this line, so probably want more people in there. Let's take a look at that. Buses and this one. We have 20, uh, we'll up that to 25. Yeah, I'm just a bit worried about this station here. Too many people waiting. I think as we get more buses, this will improve. So like, for example, we have this one now and yeah, this is an empty station. What about there? We have a lot of buses there. Oh, that's a lot in there. 46. 37. I think if we want to connect Fresno to Tempe, we might need a junction in here to make that work. Same thing here, but let's try with the easy way and then we, we take a look at that. So more passengers, again this is the one that's viable at the moment. I'll get I don't know, 15 for this line and let's get to Fremont to McAllen and then we will have a busy road here. But it's good that we can now upgrade our roads to, I think, six lanes, is that it? Yeah, extra large streets. Depending on how we go here with uh, all these buses, I, I'll do that. 
So many buses. It's good that the cars can just go past that. Yeah, I'm sorry that'll be a little bit busy at the moment, but as soon as those buses go, there you go. Then it should be alright. Nice. Do have some tools waiting, machines rather, waiting over there. So we connected Fremont and Fresno, we connected Fremont and McAllen, we also connected Topeka, which we weren't expecting, but as I could see there was a lot of uh, passengers waiting there, we, uh, I thought that would be a good idea. So I think the only one that's missing is Tempe. I probably connect Tempe, Fresno and McAllen in one go. Or hmm, I'm, I'm still thinking about that. Not sure if that uh, that's a great idea, but let's see. Transport in here. How are we doing? Lot of people going there. Lot of people going there. So public transport is growing a lot here. That's very good. Now. Where are they going? Are they going to... I don't know... Hmm, how can I see what's private and what's public? Fresno. Okay. So Fresno just goes... It's not Fresno that I want to see, it's Tempe. I'm sorry. Okay, they go both ways, but it's uh, higher to Fresno, so we are definitely connecting there. And here we have a lot of people as well. And maybe I'll connect them in just one go. Let's do it. Let's connect it there. So a new line. And we have new trucks. Nice. I'll start it here. Go there. Then I'll get in here, there, and finish this here. I'll connect it there as well. Go back here. Hmm, how this is going? This comes straight, turn. Okay, this might not be a good idea, but let's see how that goes. And then stop here, stop there. and finish here. Okay, so this is... McAllen, Tempe and Fresno. McAllen, Tempe, Fresno, Passenger. Do I have somewhere closer. Yeah, I can buy vehicles here. Good. Passenger. Oh, there is one that finished. We probably get, are getting new buses soon, which is good. For this line, I will go a little bit crazy in here. We have a lot of passengers and it's a huge line. So let's go with 30 vehicles and let's get into it. Exciting. Let's see how our other lines are going. I'm really excited about this. We first time we are building passenger uh, Is it the first time? Yeah, the first time we're building passenger lines. We even got the achievements for them And I really want to see how we are doing there uh, Losing a lot of money. Not very good <laughs> So this one is the new line That's all right uh, This one it's cargo, so at the moment I don't care about that. So Fremont, McAllen. So connecting these two cities, this is not going so well. Mm -hmm. Let's take a look at how that's going. Destination layer. Let's change McAllen. Let's remove this for a second.
Yeah, there is actually some private transport coming from here and going there. Interestingly enough, it's not making a lot of money. Mm, why? Why is that? Oh, now we are. Okay. Maybe it was just because we just started that as well and it was still waiting. I want to see this one though. This one is making a lot of money. Half a million dollars on this passenger line here. Oh, that's so good. So that's the Fremont Fresno Topeka. So the line, let me just close this. This line here that goes all the way to Fresno and finish in Topeka. That's so good. I want to connect this as well. That is nice. I like that. For our first public transportation, this is really good. Now, we do have a lot of people in here, which I might change for... Zero, this is going straight. Yeah, I might change that to a junction, but now we got some new vehicles in here. We might need more vehicles there. Maybe that's all we need. Let's see, how many do we have? Vehicles. Let's go passenger, Fremont, Fresno, Topeka. So this is going there. I like that they don't cross in here. They go this side and go there. Um, how many do we have? 25. So I might want, I don't know, let's get five more and let's see if that makes any, any change there. So we are making a lot of money on this line, so I think it's fine to get more capacity in there, especially in this area, it's very, very busy here as well. Mm, this might call for the first time ever buildings. What was that? Oh, highways. Yes. How do I get there? Oh, I probably select this one. Yes, but what I was saying is that this might call for this bus station here. Uh, but yes, highways. Let's do it. Want a highway there? Want a highway there? Oh, that looks good. Although all the trucks have stopped in there. And I really don't like that. Maybe do this, do that. Oh, please. Don't break. Well, I'll keep doing it. So we can get a highway in there. Oh, why all the vehicles are just getting stuck? That's not fun. That's alright, and I'll probably start the highway around here. I wish we had that a few years ago, so I could have done this at the beginning. But it's alright, at least we get it now. Here as well, and we finish that. Nice, look at that, our highway is connected good we might have an issue here double slip switch what is that oh i see what i've done there no highways are just one way uh oh no Oh no! Well, 
What do I do now? How do I do this? Hmm, so... Our traffic is on the right side, okay. But at least now I know what's going on. Let's just fix that. Okay, this area is done. Oh, this is gonna take a while. So let's go over there. Oh, how do I make the junction here work? Oh, uh, so many questions. Like, it's like I never played City Skylines, right? It's just a junction, but... <laughs> But I'm just having like a really hard time here to, to make these connections to work. I don't know why. There you go. That's done. Uh, I'm happy with that now. So let's take a look at our, our lines here. From... Hmm. McAllen... McAllen to Tempe, that's broken, so let's take a look at that later. Okay, so we are now connected here, so this should fix one of the lines. McAllen Fremont, I think. Yeah. Oh, look at our connections here. So I believe we are finally done now. Let's see how this all goes, and hopefully we we got everything right. Uh, okay, our buses are finally moving. Oh, this is not connected yet. So Fresno to Topeka to Tempe. We have this one connection here, which is done on both sides, that's good, we don't have anything else going out of the road here at the moment, so it's alright. Oh, I just found where we can get some refined oil, but then we can't do anything with the oil around here, at least at the moment. But there you go, they are happily going around now. Hopefully this all fixed our issue uh, with these highways now that we have. I just love this area here. I've, I think like this is the, the best thing I've done on <laughs> Transport Fever ever. So yeah i hope you guys enjoy it uh this was like a complete overhaul of doing and redoing our uh road system connecting these cities just to get passengers uh all around those cities which i think was a very good decision that i that i made because this was making us money i don't know if it's still uh well not as much now because we we actually got stuck for, for some time before I noticed we, we had issues. But in any case, I think this will make things a lot faster, uh, especially when we get new uh, buses as well. So faster buses, this will be just perfect for what we need. But yeah, uh, really, really happy with what we achieved so far and i hope you guys enjoyed this as well if you like this video please don't forget to hit that like button also don't forget to subscribe and send me some comments to what you want to see in the next episodes and i'll make sure that i will do uh, some of that if they make sense obviously but thanks again and i'll see you guys in the next one bye bye